Hi everybody, this is Nicolas Prudon from the popular site SEO Head by Nicolas Prudon. In today's short video, I'm going to try to show you how to find and identify a proper niche for your website very quickly and easily. So first let's go in Google and assume that I want to start an e-commerce site selling uh, baby shoes. So I will start to type my keywords here, baby shoes. As you can see as I type, I already see some different suggestions made by Google. Eventually, you can already look from uh, keywords here that are matching. We are looking for buying keywords. So, things like baby shoe size or baby shoes size chart are not really interesting for, for me. However, when I see baby shoes discount, somebody looking for that is probably looking to buy shoes. So, this is a keyword I want to write down and keep in my mind. Anyway, let's go back to our main niche and follow with our search. Okay, when it comes to baby shoes, we can see on Google that there is over 51 million competitors there for that term. So it is extremely competitive. Uh, even with good knowledge of search engine optimization, you will have a very, very hard time to rank very well for that search term. What can we see also on this page? There is alternative search results made by Google, such as uh, images here and shopping results. Shopping result. This is very good because this means that people are buying in this niche. And this is why Google suggests uh, such things. And we can see the average price is about $20. Scroll down. There's also some uh, search related. I come back to this later. And on the right side, we also see some ads. Now, I'm in Malaysia, so the ads might not be current. So the best way to do is let's go to use Google AdWords tools and uh, see what we can get more about it. Okay, when it comes to the keyword baby shoes, there is a 1 million search volume and uh, in America and actually a global search volume in average of 1.5 million. That's absolutely huge. So traffic wise, we absolutely don't have anything to worry. Remember the price of the baby shoes was about $20. Here we look at the different ad cost per click. It's an average of one dollar plus per click. So this is very interesting so far. Let's go a little bit further and look then at what ads do you really have huh, in America. So I will use the ad preview tool to see an equivalence in America. And as you can see, there is 313 ads made huh, for baby shoes. This is absolutely huge. Here you will be able to see a lot more uh, keywords ID also such as little baby shoes uh, so be on, on the lookout like petty page soft, soft shoes there's, there's just so many keywords obviously this niche is very easy to monetize however there is still too much competition so like I said before in one of my posts when you see Google really su suggestion and related search it doesn't mean it's related. What it means is people who search for baby shoes actually were looking for one of these other terms. Uh, so if you had a site on baby shoes, people would go to your website, then they would go back to Google and they will enhance their search with one of those terms. So let's further on and let's try cool baby shoes, for example. Okay, when we come to cool baby shoes, you can see that we still have the, the pictures. There's still some ads in Malaysia, so there is less, but I ought to believe that in America there is more. Uh, they, we still have shopping results, so this is still working very well. The competition now is 22 million. It's less than half already. Can you see that? It's, but nonetheless, it's still way too much for us. Let, let's see how, how further we, we could go to this. Cool baby clothes. No, we are selling baby shoes. Nike. So this is a brand. This is very targeted. A brand. Uh, infant toddler, infant girl shoes. Uh, okay. Let's try infant boy shoes, for example. 674,000. Now we're getting a, a lot better. There is still suggestion. So let, let's dig even deeper. Uh, thread red infant shoes, pretty pen infant shoes. Infant boy sketching. Let's try sketches infant shoes. Okay, so what we can see on this page now is 
the competition have dropped only to 94,000 website, less than 100,000 compared to 54 million we had initially. There is still some suggestion by Google for shopping, which means not only we got traffic on this page, uh, there is people searching, there is search volume, but this is people who are looking to buy. This is why you have shopping result. So this is very, very important for us. You can see you also can extend. There is more search. There is more room for this part of the site. As we look on the ads now, uh, and for measure I say, so this is not very relevant. Let's go and look on the AdWords preview tools and see how many ads we have actually for this. We still got 20 ads here actually for the these keywords. Uh, Sketches infant shoes. So this is absolutely huge. Actually, this is a lot, a lot. All those people are actually paying uh, to appear on this page. Now we could, of course, also write some different uh, pay-per-click advertising uh, to be there alongside with them. We know that if we list our products uh, in a Different uh, shopping areas such as Amazon and Zappos, we have also an increased chance to appear on number one position here. But let's consider, of course, search engine optimization. And when we look at the number of sites with backlink, when we make a search with all in encore for the search term sketches, infant shoes, what do we see? There is only two sites uh, competing using anchor text to link to them with this word which means within less than a week I can guarantee I get a number one ranking almost effortlessly and maybe within three days I can get a number one ranking for this search term this is just how easy it can be for you when you search and you can go there by each keywords like that you make your, your research and you, you will find some amazing things very quickly uh, without the use of many complicated tools. Okay, this, this is it uh, for this video. I hope it has been uh, useful for you. Thank you for watching. If you have any question or if you need more information, don't hesitate to come to my website uh, where you can find a lot more of those videos or articles I have written. Uh, so just go to www nicolasprudent.com that's n i c o l a s p r u d h o n